Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and Pokemon fans of the world, welcome. So, I just got back from the gym from an amazing chest workout, and I decided to throw in a little bit of cardio too, just to work on my cardiovascular system. Now, despite what I just said, this video has nothing to do with working out. As a matter of fact, I come at you guys completely out of character to present you guys with a couple of disclaimers to take into consideration while viewing this video. Now, this video, like the last time I did a video like this where I did a reaction video to Jethro Texas video, this right here is going to be another reaction video to one of my all-time favorite YouTubers known as Arizio or Arizio. I apologize if I butcher the pronunciation of your name, man. But I just gotta say that this individual not only has some of the best content that I've ever seen, but he also has one of the most best intros that I've ever seen. Like, my god, like, his intro is just, it's fire. No pun intended, because, you know, his intro consists of fire and all that stuff. But anyways, ladies and gentlemen, so, in this video, I will be coming at you guys in my Mega Crasher character, as I normally do when it comes to reaction videos, to not only hype up the entertainment and overall energy value of the video itself, but to give you guys as much out of this as possible. Now, secondly, before we proceed to the video, I would also like to preface this by saying that this video that I'm going to be reacting to will be in the description box down below. Please go over to the original video and show it the amount of love and support that it truly deserves. Deserves because I have a feeling that I'm going to have a great time uh, reacting to this video like I did with Jethro Tex's uh, top uh, top list for worst shiny Pokemon. This right here is going to be top five worst shiny Pokemon coming from Arisio. So y'all know that this video already is going to be filled with insanity, filled with lots of fun and all that stuff. So definitely check out Arisio. Show him the amount of love that he deserves because he truly deserves it, you know. His content is some of the best I've ever seen. So with all that being said, know the way, ladies and gentlemen, it is time to get into character. So I will see you guys in a moment. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and Pokemon fans of the world, Mega Crasher is here. And are you guys ready to see a hyped as hell reaction video? And this is going to be consisting of a video from uh, the one and only Arisio. And we're going to be checking out his video on... <laughs> Top 5 Worst Shiny Pokemon in Pokemon Sun and Moon. Now, it's going to be very interesting to see what his choices are. Because I got to say, man, that everybody's got different tastes. And I always, always respect them. Even if I don't always agree and I rage out like a maniac. But with all that being said, ladies and gentlemen, set your phasers to stun, get hyped, stay hyped, and let's do this. Woo! Here we go, baby. Yeah! Here we go. Shiny Pokemon are some of the most sought after creatures in the entire franchise. You damn right! Shinies make it well worth the to get. Shiny Weezing, baby. Oh yeah! I fucking love those shinies. Oh my god. What is that thing? It's a shiny Sharpedo! Oh oh god, I think I'm gonna puke. How are you gonna puke? Oh my god. Oh shit, this is gonna this is gonna be a barn burner, man. Shiny Absol's really good though! Oh man. Yes! Decidui, baby! So with that being said, welcome to my top five worst shiny Pokemon in Pokemon Sun and Moon. This is gonna get good. I will be making a best shiny Pokemon video to counter this as well. Yeah, let's go, baby! Like, subscribe, and share this video with a friend. Do it, man! Do it up! Let's get started. Here we go. Here we go. Yes, that's the intro I'm talking about. Oh yes, man. This intro makes me feel warm and fuzzy inside. That's because the fire, baby. Fucking hell! I love your intros, man. First Pokemon, I will admit I have a bias against it. Bruxish is one of the dumbest, ugliest, and the worst excuse for a Pokemon to be brought into the new games. It especially makes it worse that this thing is supposed to be based on the Reef Triggerfish, better known yeah. as the Hum Hum Hum. 
Humanukumuku or something. I, I don't know. Which is the most sacred fish in all of Hawaii. Yeah. Honestly, you can get arrested if you hunt these things. And you damn right, right, baby. This thing feels like a spit to the face of the Hawaiian state fish. Now, finally, ranting aside, let's talk about the shiny. Oh, God, please kill me now. No! He just really seemed all over the place. Well, here's the thing, man, is that shiny Bruxish may look like a Christmas piranha fish looking thing with a flower on its head or something that opens and closes, but you want to know something? Shiny Bruxish is kind of awesome. But, hey, to each their own, right? To each their own. I respect your taste, man. Just put the entire color wheel in there, why don't you, Game Freak? Yeah, they should have done that, actually. as well but i hate this pokemon and its colors so <laughs> the same thing for the shiny i'm gonna hate it too so f you don't don't add this damn thing. plus isn't it the goal to holy shit he just strips the so fuck you will say that it does look better than its regular form but how hard uh, is it to do that uh, I'm, I'm 50 50 on that baby but shiny bruxish is always amazing because it's a fucking shiny bro here we go with number four. Okay, what's gonna happen with number four? Mudsdale Shiny suffers from the overhyped shiny expectation syndrome. Look it up, it's common in every <laughs> I'm more disappointed in Mudsdale Shiny than God, that shiny's disgusting! So much better. Oh man! Just, just, just look at it. But no, we got the annoying orange here to ruin <laughs> hopes and dreams. Fuck you, Dane Bo. There's not really much else to say about this shiny. Uh. With blue hair and you could have looked so cool. Oh my so god. You see what Why couldn't they do it that way? Like regular Mudsdale looks just so fucking fine, man. But no but 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 okay, before we proceed to number three, shiny Mudsdale kind of looks like someone dumped like a bucket of puke on it. I mean, no disrespect to those who actually like shiny Mudsdale and stuff. I mean, shinies are shinies, okay? Even if they're good colors or bad colors, they're fucking shiny Pokemon. I mean, hell, I hatched a shiny Mudbraid the other day, and even though it may not be one of my favorite shinies, it's still a fucking shiny Pokemon, baby. Woo! I thought I was going to get sick from seeing shiny Mudsdale. The holy fuck, man. That was an ugly-ass shiny. I agree there. Okay, Game Freak, I am seriously getting tired of you guys constantly making these pseudo-legendary shinies look bad. I mean, yeah. Look at these. Crap, crap, fuck off. Well, no, 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 that one, that, whoa, 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 hey, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Pokemon should have bad shinies, although. Oh, man. But none of them should have bad shinies. And when I saw Kamo-O. Yes, Kamo-O, another bad shiny. I thought it was a good idea to combine pink and green together for No, 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 no. That was, it, it's like I said in the last video with Jeff Tex, it looks like someone took a fucking golden shower on this commando dragon and decided to splash it with pink paint. Who in the right mind thinks that pink and a piss yellowish greenish color looks good together? Seriously, Game Freak, get your shit together, man. I mean, if you hired a shiny expert like myself, well, uh, shiny, not shiny expert as in like a shiny hunter or whatever, but 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 but, but with my my crazy mind and imagination, man, I'm sure I can come up with some pretty sexy shiny patterns for these Pokemon that have pretty gross looking shinies, man. I'm not even gonna lie, this one is not a good shiny. Two of the most hated shiny colors of all time. It's Fuck. It's not a good green either. It's like a greenish yellow. It actually kind of looks like urine a bit if you look. Dude! It. Yes! No? I agree. Just me? I fucking know. I agree. You guys have weird pee. I agree, dude. Fun aside, though, this leads I to agree. I point about looking desirable. Would you really put in the time and effort to get a shiny Kamoa when you know that its regular form is 20 times better? No, I well, yeah. The, good, good point. Good point. All right, number two, baby. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Listen, I know what you're going to say, but trust me. I don't hate green shinies. No. Shiny Lurantis sucks real bad. What? It sucks more than your local hooker. Oh! Oh, 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 shoot, oh, man, Arisio, fucking savage, what the fuck, oh, 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 shit, honestly, don't think that 
the shiny is bad because of the greenish yellow color. It's I actually really like this that shiny though. If you're trying to give Lorantis more of an environmental look, then don't give it these dead colors. Up the saturation. I do kind of agree with that point there. I agree. I agree. Just look at this. I played around with the shiny on Photoshop for two. I mean, like, he, like here's the thing with shiny Lorantis, like. They, they could have made its uh, green uh, green colors look a little bit more vibrant. Like, it's as he pointed out, you know, uh, to match with the environment, the tropical environment, right? But, you know what? It's like, in all honesty, this is not the, a bad shiny whatsoever, friends. This is not a bad shiny. Like, holy fuck. That's actually a really... Like, you know what? It's like, if I, if I came across a shiny Fomantis, like, I would fuck... Uh, dude, without question, regardless if the shiny is shit or not, I would catch it because it's fucking rare and stuff. But, like, you know, shiny, shiny Lorantis would be a Pokemon that I would go out of my way for to have, uh, you know, on my shiny competitive team if I was to have one kind of thing, right? Minutes and made a better version, in my opinion. Okay, here we go. All I'm saying is keep the shiny green. I like that. Make it a shade that doesn't make it look depressing. Liven up a little, man. Let's see, let's see your shiny version. God damn it. Alright, what do we got for his number one? We are the number one spot. And I know you may be thinking that there is no shiny that could be worse than any of these, but trust me, there is. Oh there shit. Is one singular Pokemon that is most Oh shit. Oh shit, here we go. The worst shiny Pokemon in all of Sun and Moon. And the Oscar goes to Cosma. Congratulations! Oh! Ho -ho! <laughs> Nebby! Oh, baby! No! Oh, shit! <laughs> Why am I congratulating you? You suck. I'm sorry, but how could you not expect to see this shiny at this spot? Look at the two. Do you see any changes between them? The circle cheek thing. Yeah, the 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 the, 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 the cheeks. That's about it. Uh, I know this thing is shiny locked, but I don't care. F this thing and all it stands for. Oh my god! Cosmog's laughable shiny is Marshadow, but I don't really want to put it on this list because it isn't technically an official Pokemon yet. But it still sucks. I mean, look at it. Either oh! way, Cosmog Shiny is by far the worst shiny in Sun and Moon, and looking at some of the shinies fans made, it could have looked a- Oh! That, that's a missed opportunity right there, Game Freak! Please. Oh my god! Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like and let me know in the comment section below. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel and become an Aribro today. I know this was a bit yeah, of a- Yeah, buddy! I will say that, you know, even though, like, I, like... Okay, here's the thing. This is purely my own opinion. Yeah, it, it's your opinion, which I, I respect, even though I kind of almost upchucked when the shiny Mudsdale and stuff like that, but still, though. As long as you respect my opinion, I'll respect yours. Yeah, baby, that's what it's all about, man! And if you guys want to see the other worst shiny video, the link to that will be the other annotation on the right. And with that being said, oh, shit. I'll see you guys next time. We have another worst shiny video. All right, baby. All right, all right. I, I, I can get on board with that. I can get on board with that, man. Woo! But I just gotta say, this one was a fucking doozy. Like, it was so awesome. Like, the way that he put his video together and stuff. What the hell? Like... Adding humor, you know, like, sure, the list got narrowed down to 5 instead of 10, but holy shit, dude. Damn, that was good. That was really good. And, and you know what? It's like, like, okay, it's like, I disagreed with Fomant, or sorry, Lorantis being one of the worst shinies, because I, I, I honestly, uh, I honestly don't think it's that bad of a shiny. Like, it's, it's really not that bad. I mean, sure, they could have livened up the, uh, the shiny colors a little bit to make it look a little bit more tropical looking. But, you know, it's like having a greenish yellow, a green, and a light blue mixed in. It actually looks pretty good. But I just gotta say, though, man, like, like, I'm actually surprised that he didn't put, like, a uh, shiny shin on it because it literally looks like a fucking mushroom rolled in shit. No disrespect to those who actually like shiny shin though. Please don't need choke me. This is just my opinion, though, man. And, hey, it's as Arisio said. 
As long as you respect my opinion, I'll respect yours. I mean, by default, I respect your opinion as long as you're respectful about mine, kind of thing. You know what I'm saying, bro? But anyways, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to conclude this video. So if you guys enjoyed the video, then make sure you smash the hell out of the like button, man. And I didn't set a like goal at the beginning of the program, which I should have, man. But let's aim for 25 likes, baby. And if you want more content like this, make sure you rate, comment, share, share, share this video. And subscribe today, baby, to Mega Crasher in the community for the best. And I mean, without a shadow of a doubt, the best Pokemon Sun and Moon hype that you can find right now, right here on YouTube. And just overall, the best hype and entertainment. Filled with fire, filled with electricity, filled with overall energy. Coming from this crazy nut house known as Mega Crasher. Because you guys already know the deal by now, my friends. When we're community type act on this one, you know that we shine brighter than the sun and the moon combined. So thanks for watching. And also, like I said at the beginning of the program, make sure you check out the original video. Links are in the description box down below. Please go and subscribe to Arisio if you haven't already, man. You know, he truly deserves all the love and support, man, for videos like these. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next upload. Woo!